Hello, my name is Claude Laporte. I am the professor at ATS and Engineering School in Montreal, and I'm also the editor of a new ISO standard 29110 that has been specially designed for very small entities. Uh, a very small entity is a standalone enterprise, a department, a project which has up to 25 uh, people. We developed, uh, or ISO mandated us to develop a new standard for those uh, VSEs because we found out uh, from our expertise and background that VSEs uh, have a negative perception regarding uh, international standards. VSEs do not use uh, standard in their daily operations, and most of their process is ad hoc or chaotic. So there was an opportunity there to develop a set of standards and guides that will allow VSEs to be more efficient in the development of their software. Uh, we conducted a survey, an international survey, and we went into the trouble of translating the survey into nine languages to make sure that we could reach as many people as possible in their native language. So we had uh, four, over 435 responses from 32 countries. One of the things that came out of this survey is that the vast majority of VSCs are asking us for more guidances and examples. They ask us to develop light documents with guidelines and examples. Also, they wanted to have a mean to get some recognition, some international recognition, such that they can do business outside their country also. To do that, we develop a set of profiles. So a profile is a, it's like an assemblage of existing standards. The, the reason is we don't want to reinvent the wheel every time. So we took bits, bits, bits and pieces of existing standards and we assemble them in what we call profiles. So we have developed profiles, and prof a profile is like, uh, or a set of profiles, is like a, a roadmap. So we have developed four profiles. The first profile is called the entry profile, and it is targeted at VSC that are in the startup mode, or for VSC that have very small project of the, uh, of a, let's say, of six person month or less. The second profile is a basic profile for VSCs developing one project at a time. The intermediate profile is targeted at VSC at, uh, developing more than one project at a time. And the advanced profile is for targeted VSC to uh, help them sustain and grow and uh, manage their portfolio of projects. We have developed a set of documents, five documents uh, targeted by audience. So the three of those documents are technical reports and those three technical reports are available at no cost from the ISO website. Or on my website, you will find the hyperlink to go to the ISO website to obtain those three documents. So I suggest to a VAC to have a look at part one, which is the overview, and this document describes the concept of the standards developed especially for them. The most important document for the VSC is the Engineering and Management Guide, which is called part five. As mentioned, the Engineering and Management Guide has two processes, a project management process and an implementation process or an engineering process. So a customer will come into business by uh, giving a statement of work to a project manager and the project manager will prepare a plan and the plan will be used by his team of software engineers or software de developers to develop the product. Eventually the product will be handed over to the project manager which will hand over the product to the customer. Uh, in order to help us develop uh, the standard and also to diffuse the standards uh, around the world, we have set up a network of centers. And it's this network of centers is composed of uh, centers which are mainly uh, uh, organized or focused on uh, very small enterprises. So we are now uh, have a, a network of centers in Belgium, in Brazil. Naturally, we have one in Canada. We have one in Colombia, in Finland, in France, in Hong Kong, Ireland, Luxembourg, uh, Mexico, Thailand, and more recently, uh, we have now a hub with uh, Haiti. Uh, in order to further help VSCs in applying the engineering and management guide, we have developed a set of deployment packages. So the intention is, or the idea is, that we know that a VSC is very busy uh, serving its customer and don't have time, uh, or much time left, to implement processes. So. In order to help the VAC to implement the 29110 standard, we divided the standard in small components, small chunks, such that the VAC can implement a chunk at a time, a few practices at a time, 
uh, gradually and eventually be able to claim full compliance to the standard if the, that the VSC wants to. We have also ran some pilot projects all over the world to make sure that what we have developed could be used by VSCs. Uh, you will also find public website on internet where you can find this information at no cost. Lastly, uh, people developing systems with hardware ask us if we could develop uh, matching profiles in the world of systems engineering. So this work has, been, has started just a few months ago, and we are going to develop, like the software uh, engineering profiles, we're going to develop four profiles matching the software engineering profile. So we are doing, going to develop an entry profile, a basic, intermediate, and advanced profile for systems engineering houses or system engineering VACs that develop systems having hardware and software. So in, in summary, uh, I've explained to you that we have developed a new standard for VAC titled ISO 29110. We have developed deployment package to help you uh, implement the process, and we are presently developing a system engineering standard to match the existing software engineering standard. Thank you very much.